And if you do not want to participate in this election, stop giving us threats and ultimata. The IEBC is an independent institution. The IEBC cannot take instructions from any candidate. And any candidate cannot blackmail or make all ultimata to IEBC. If we go that route, we are not going to have any election. Tunaeliwana? Wa hivyo tunawambia watu wakitenda wili. You are the people who said you wanted an, an electronic register. In 2017, you went to court so that we can have an electronic register. Now you have changed corpus. Now you want to tell us you want a manual register. Please make up your mind. IEBC have already set the game for 9th of August. You better arrange yourselves and participate. Sijui kama tunaelewana ndugu zangu. Sasa mimi nataka niwaulize. Si hawa watu walituambia wako na deep state. Si walituambia wako na system. Si saa hii wanapiga makelele. Ati sijui iko shida gani na manual register. Kwani iko lazima mtu mmoja akwe kwa hii uchaguzi? Kama kitanda wili anaona hana nafasi ya kupita kwa hiyo uchaguzi, awachane na uchaguzi, wacha wa Kenya wengine wapige kura na tuendelee. Ama mnasemaje? Tunaelewana? Tunaelewana? Mimi nataka niwaambie watu wakuzimia. Now that you have discovered that you do not have the votes to win this election, and you have also discovered that the district and the system cannot help you, please stop the blackmail. Stop the intimidation. IEBC is an independent institution. It cannot take instructions from any candidate. We want to ask IEBC to carry out their mandate in accordance with the constitution and should not accept any ultimata from anybody. Whether we have a manual register, whether we have an electronic register, the people of Kenya, IEBC is the institution that has the mandate and the expertise to know how we are going to have a free and fair election. I want to say from Loyangalani, we are ready for the elections on 9th of August. Nini watu wa Loyangalani muko tayari ama muko tayari? Muko tayari ama muko tayari? Ebu nione wala nasema tuko tayari, tuko tayari, tuko tayari. participate kwa uchaguzi hakuna lazima sina mna hiyo wabadilishe candidate wao waniletee mtu mwingine wa kuangaliana na yeye ama mnasemaje watu waliangalani tunaelewana sasa si mnajua hao watu tumewashinda na akili walikuwa wanatuambia wako na deep state deep state imeshindikana wakatuambia wako na system system imeshindikana wakaambia wako na nini tumewashinda na mbinu zote sasa ati ile kitu wamebakia wanasema ati wanasema ati wataipa kura yetu sasa mimi nataka niwaulize nyinyi watu ya loyangalani si mnanijua mimi si mimi ndio niunga mkono uhuru kenyata mpaka akakuwa rais ni kweli ama si kweli kama singeunga mkono uhuru kenyata angekuwa rais angekuwa rais sasa mimi nataka niwaambie. Nyinyi mniangalie vizuri. Mkiniona hii sura yangu, mimi ni mtu mwenye ninaweza kuibiwa kura kweli ukinipima. Sio sio ni ndoto ya mchana. <laughs> eh? Sio ni ndoto ya mchana. Kwani? Kwani nyinyi watu waloyangalani? Yaani mnafikiri iko deep state ambaye mimi sijui kama naibu wa rais? Iko system ambaye mimi sijui kama naibu wa rais? Sio ni ndoto ya mchana. Kwani kitenda wili ni mtu ya serikali, serikali gani? Ni mtu ya serikali gani? Si ni mtu tu ya bandia alipita mlango ya nyuma akakuja akanyamelea aka serikali yetu. Lakini si tarehe 9 mwezi wa 8 si shetani atashindwa. Atashindwa atashindwa. Waangalani mumeamua. Mumeamua ama bado? Hebu nione wala wanasema tumeamua. Mimi nauliza nyinyi Kura yenu ni ya huyu Haslam na mjua ama kura yenu ni ile mtu ya kitenda wili ambaye hana kazi. Kura yenu ni ya nani? Kura yenu ni ya Hasla. Hebu nione kura ya Hasla hapo nione kura ya Hasla. Arambe! Arambe! Wacha nimuulize ndugu yangu anaitwa Sonya Or
ore. Unajua huyu mngwana anaitwa Sonia Ore. Ndugu zangu ni wale ngalale. Amjambo. <laughs>